timeout. Decide not to use it. Curry, way down town. Bang! Bang! Oh, what a- Curry steps back. Bang! Curry steps back. Bang! What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Chalk. And as you guys can see by the title, the thumbnail, and the introduction, and what I'm wearing today, we are on the Stephen Curry playmaking shot creator build. Now look, for those of you guys who don't follow basketball religiously and might not know, Stephen Curry has been injured majority of this season, but the good and exciting news for basketball fans such as myself is that he is eyeing a return sometime in March. March 1st, he is supposed to be evaluated by team doctors and they're going to see if he can come back and play this season. Now. Please forgive me for the fact that Steph Curry doesn't really look like Steph Curry and looks kind of more like a Steve Curry, all right? I did my best, okay? I was I was very limited in what I could do. It's hard to make people look like people. I tried, all right, guys? Can I get a Steve Curry in the comment section? But look, without further ado, let's get right into this gameplay, man. So look, I'm out here with my boy Magic, soon to be legend Magic, and listen, I was going all in for this Stephen Curry thing, all right? I put on Stephen Curry's dribble size up. I put on Stephen Curry's jump shot. I put on Stephen Curry's leaner, all right? I was gonna make sure that if I was gonna go Curry, I was gonna be completely Curry. So look, as you guys can see right away, Stephen Curry's jump shot is wet, okay? I mean, this jump shot gets a lot of green lights. Now look, would I use this jump shot over 98? Not necessarily. I'm more of a 98 kind of guy. But for people who struggle with jump shot 98, which there is a lot of people out there who struggle with it, this would be an extremely effective and consistent jump shot for you. I'm telling you guys right now, this jump shot is really good and really easy to shoot a lot of greens with, okay? It has a very simple and easy to recognize green release window. And I'm telling you guys right now, it took me literally one part game and I had this jump shot completely figured out. Now look, as you guys can see, I'm out here moving malicious, okay? When I put the curry gear on, I'm all in, all right? I'm gonna make sure I go absolutely crazy if I'm gonna make my player Stephen Curry because for those of you guys who don't know, Curry is my favorite player in the NBA. Yes, yes, I know a lot of people don't like that, but listen, I gotta respect greatness, all right? And Curry has completely changed the game of basketball and he puts on for us little guys, all right? Not everybody can be six foot eight, 280 pounds like LeBron James. But as you guys can see right here, I'm feeling a little too good. I tried to do something crazy, get that shot out of here, but it doesn't matter because I'm Curry and three is worth more than two anyways. So if you guys wanna know how to make this build and you wanna know all the specs to do it, it's literally the exact same as my new best point guard build, okay? If you wanna build a Curry, Curry is the best point guard build now, except for instead of making it 6'5", you'll obviously make it 6'3", like Steph. And yes, guys, I'm left-handed. Before you go in the comment section and you're like, Chuck, Curry's not left-handed. Why are you using a left-handed Curry? Listen, you might as well just call me Steve Curry, all right? Because look, I can't shoot with right-handed players. For whatever reason, and this has been something with me for 2K with, for the longest, I've always used left-handed my players, all right? I always use left-handed my players, and I can't use right-handed my players anymore. It's been so many years that my jump shot on righties is just broken. As you guys see right there, I'm throwing an absolute dime to my dog, Magic. Hezzy green. But like I was saying, if you want to make a Stephen Curry build for yourself, I will leave that video at the end. You know how you can click on the videos at the end? I'll put that at the end of the video. That way you guys can build one for yourself. And there will probably be a card that pops up in the top right of your screen right here if you want to be able to build that. But I'm telling you guys, the playmaking Hall of Fame and shooting Hall of Fame is the meta now. Those builds are so glitchy. With the removal of the behind the back, all the playmaking badges got buffed. And now having Hall of Fame playmaking is almost a must. But as you guys can see by this film so far, I was moving malicious. I'm telling you guys, there was not a game that we played where I felt like we weren't going to win or it was even going to be close. I was comboing up. I was getting to every spot I want to get to on the court and even the whites were falling. And look guys, once I get 
the shot creating takeover, you might as well say goodbye because I'm not missing any shot. It's just not going to happen. I have shot creator takeover. Just you might as well quit the game, close app, something because the game is over at that point. Just concede defeat and say goodbye. As you guys can see, another green for the left-handed Stephen Curry. But guys, I cannot wait to see Stephen Curry's return to the NBA. It just almost doesn't feel the same this year. Like, even though so many great players are arising, like Trey Young, Luka Doncic, all these guys are starting to really come into their own. With Steph being injured, with KD being injured, it's almost like the NBA is just missing such a big piece. I don't know about you guys, but the NBA just doesn't feel the same to me. If you guys agree, let me know in the comment section. Maybe I'm just biased because I'm fans of Curry and KD, but it's like, man, you're missing out on two generational talents and the best shooter of all time, guys. I'm telling you right now, appreciate Curry while you can because you're never going to see another one i don't care what anybody says man stephen curry is different and there's a reason you haven't seen anybody like him and a reason he's taken the nba by storm the way that he has because his play style is so unique and so different and that's why the warriors in general are so fun to watch not this year's warriors who are absolutely abysmal but the stephen curry led warriors who absolutely go crazy as you see right there tell me that's not stephen curry like Passing up on the easy two, sprinting out to the three-point line and knocking it down. Scores 18-0 and bang, as Mike Breen would say, another three for Stephen Curry. Now, I want to know you guys' opinion on this as well, okay? I genuinely believe that Stephen Curry is the greatest point guard of all time, all right? But I know that's a very unpopular opinion, okay? There are so many great point guards that the NBA has had, but I genuinely feel like none of them have impacted the game and absolutely dominated it the way that Curry has. Would you guys agree or disagree? In my opinion, Curry's different. Look at the relocation. You guys can't tell me that's not Curry. Like anybody who watches the Warriors and anybody who watches Stephen Curry knows how he moves without the ball. That's what makes him so dangerous. He's already lethal with the ball but he's so lethal without it it's like he just continuously runs around the court and you can't stop him as you guys see right here i'm chaining up these combos man i'm finally starting to really understand the game without the behind the back hashtag rest in peace to the behind the back but man i'm starting to get my dribble sequences down i'm really starting to move good as you see right there bailout kicks in i relocate and knock down the easy wide open three ball but i'm telling you guys man i'm really starting to understand this game as you guys saw by my wager the other day i'm actually moving different okay i'm dominating i'm playing really well but listen this build right here once i can badge out my own playmaking shot creator i'm going to be absolutely unguardable guys playmaking shot creators are the meta in this patch okay i know everybody is running these two-way slashing playmakers the only problem with the two-way slashing playmaker is gold quick draw is hard to get your shot up as you guys see i'm sorry i know that's off topic but look at me go i'm out here doing some crazy stuff man but like i was saying the two-way slashing playmakers not that they're dead but i just don't think that they're personally as good as builds that can do stuff like this genuinely watch what i'm doing right now how in the world are you supposed to guard me when i'm getting all these angle breakers listen guys this build is not even close to being maxed yet so imagine this build maxed out i'm going to be moving absolutely different but yes guys that is the end of today's video i appreciate each and every one of you who took the time out of your day to click on this video man i hope you guys enjoyed watching steph curry dominate the park now look if you guys are fans of mine and have not been paying attention i have been streaming on twitch lately guys okay i still do stream on youtube but what i don't do is intertwine the youtube streams with the youtube uploads okay so on the days that i upload youtube videos i will not stream on youtube and usually i stream on twitch during those times so this right here is the name of the twitch account be sure to go follow that guys i don't even just stream 2k okay i've been streaming a little bit of tinder i like to mix it up guys trust me it's good content on there if you have not followed me on twitch already you are missing out 
Also be sure to follow me on Twitter guys because there's giveaways on the way and who doesn't like the opportunity to win free stuff, all right? All you have to do is follow me on Twitter and turn the notifications on and you guys can win a lot of cool and free stuff. I'm telling you guys, I'm going to be giving a lot of different things away, so be on the lookout for that. But look guys, thank you so much for tuning into this video. I can't thank each and every one of you enough. As always, it's your boy Chalk, and I'm out. Peace.